guys in this video we will be learning json in python now see what is json dot dump okay so json dot dump actually is used to serialize a python object and write it to the json file okay we are writing a file now json file through the python object okay and function takes two arguments the python object and the file object okay so what we are going to do we have simple string we will be opening a file that is a function open function and we'll be passing let's say that is our data one dot json we we are going to say okay and we are saying that is the parameter for writing as file okay and uh, you can say json module dot dump this is a function which actually dump the data to the file okay in your memory so we are going to say that this is our string okay it accepts strings and we are saying that is our file object right this is our file object you see right if we execute this code and run this so it actually generate the file a data bundled json file into the current project okay if you want to see where file is created actually see data dot json it is the same location right okay so we have successfully write some data into the file this file that is used by this json dot dump function okay now let's see what is json dot load function so json dot load function is nothing but to read a json file and parse it contents into a python objects again we are going to read this file and we are going to create an object in python okay pretty simple it takes single argument the file object and return a python object for us so let's say we have a file okay and the same code we are going to use okay so we have already written this file so i am commenting out this code right because otherwise it will create another file it will conflict with the same file name and now i am going to make it r because we are going to read the same file and instead of dump i am going to use the load method right okay this load method and we don't need this s2 because we are going to load the file and this load function will return us the object okay let me make it object 2 okay very simple right so this is not intended okay now it is fine and we are going to print the object object 2 okay simple let's end the program you see read the file and we got the output okay let's say if you want to okay if you want to change anything on the json and you want to make is instead of 30 to 50 and we have saved the file and if you want to run the program again so you will get age is 50. you see we have got the updated data now right so these are four very important function from this module which can do so many things in python we see how we can convert python list to the json okay converting python list to json format you can use json dot dumps okay we have already uh, seen json dot dumps but this time we'll be using the list object okay instead of the dictionary will be using list okay how we can do it so maybe uh, we will be creating a list l1 so this type of data we have taken in form of list it has int type of data it has string type of data in this list okay so we are going to dump the data right so how we are going to dump json dot dumps and my list object we are going to pass it will return us what it returns it will return us the string okay 
So I am going to take this time as three and it will print it. Print as three. Okay. Press in the program a string. Okay. Because it actually dumps it. Okay. Object we have dumped into the string and we have got the string. You see. Okay. This is Python list to JSON. Okay. That brings us to the end of the today's video. We hope you found it informative and engaging. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more exciting content on all things tech related. Thanks for watching and we will see you in the next video.